very, very excited. So today, I am curious, have you ever been somewhere where you cannot see? Have you ever been somewhere where there are so many grown-ups and you cannot see what's going on? Have you ever had that happen? What, when, is it, when has that happened to you? At parties and you can't see where else? At a football game, you can't see where else? A football game? At the fair or show? Soccer games? Yes, it's frustrating when we want to see something and we are just sometimes not tall enough. In a little while, Pastor David is going to tell a story about a man named Zacchaeus. And it says, he was a wee little man. Do you know what wee means? Small, yes. My sister, when she was little, she used to sing a song. Zacchaeus was a wee little man. Do you even know that? A wee little man was he? And she would end the song with, well, I'll sing it for you. Zacchaeus was a wee little man. A wee little man was he. He climbed up to a sycamore tree for the Lord he wanted to see. And as the Lord was passing by, he looked up in the tree and said, Zacchaeus, you come down, for I'm coming to your house today, for I'm coming to your house today. And then my sister would always add, to eat chicken and rice. I have no idea why she created a menu for Jesus and Zacchaeus. But Zacchaeus was this little man, and he could not see because of this crowd, and he wanted to see Jesus. But what's amazing is that Jesus sees him up in the tree. And not only does he see him, but he says, I am coming over to your house. Now, what would you make for Jesus if he came over to your house to eat? Maybe chicken and rice. What would you make? Homemade pizza. Cake. Mashed potatoes. Oh, my goodness. And then think about what would you talk about with Jesus? What would you talk about having dinner with Jesus? Yeah. Oh my goodness, you tell him. Oh no, so you tell funny stories about your sister. Oh my goodness. What else would you talk, what would you talk to Jesus about? You'd ask him a million questions. So you would tell him someday in the future, people are going to dress up like a ketchup and a mustard. That's so funny. It is fun to imagine not only being able to see Jesus and Jesus seeing us, but also to like what would it be like to have a meal with Jesus? In a little while, you guys are going to go into kids' church, and you're going to continue to talk about what would it mean to have a meal with Jesus. And what happens to Zacchaeus, this wee little man, is his life changes. He changes the way in which he wants to live and how he wants to treat other people. And that is something that we continue to learn is how Jesus, when he sees us and he loves us and he eats with us, my goodness, our lives are changed. So please pray with me. Holy and gracious God, thank you for today. And please help us to know that you see us and you love us. Amen. Amen. Okay, you guys can follow.